Hi, I wanted to pop on quickly here and share a little, do a little demo or share a little tip, whatever you want to call it, um, for people. I had somebody ask me the other day about how you use these metal tips with the art glitter glue. And it's not actually the first time somebody has asked. So I thought I would do a little video showing you exactly how to do that. So first of all, we sell the art glitter um, in a variety of sizes, including two and four ounce, as well as a bigger eight ounce and a bunch of refills and different ones. Anyways, these metal tips are made to work with the two and four ounce size bottles. So that's important to know that if you have an eight ounce or a 16 ounce or anything like that, these tips will not work with those size of bottles. Although those bottles are a little bit bigger, they make it a little bit more awkward to use and cumbersome as well. So I would recommend if you have a bigger size to pour your glue into a smaller size for the wor a working bottle. Anyways, so again, these tips work with the two and four ounce size. So what you do is you take, when you get your glitter glue, it has a cap that you just twist and take off. So it has your narrower tip there. And if you want to make it even more for precision, you have one of these comes like this on a little carded thing. I don't have the card anymore, sorry. Comes with a pin that you can put in the top when you're not using it, as well as this little metal tip with a very fine tip on it. So all you do is hold your bottle, you put your tip on there. While you're pushing down, you turn. So twist and put it down and just kind of give it a good little thing. And then you'll be able to tell you can pull on it and it doesn't come off. You know, you can pick your bottle up by it that it's on there. So once it's on, it's good. You can put, and you should put the pin, let's see if I can do this. From the distance, the eyes are not quite as good. There we go. It's a little hard when you're filming and you gotta hold it away from your face, but there you go. And they, a good tip, do not put this all the way down. If you put it all the way down to the very top of the tip, there is a chance if you have any glue on there when you're using it, it will glue and dry and you will glue this to your tip. So you want to keep it up a little bit and then you won't have any problems with it. And then you'll be able to easily get it out as you're working on your projects. And it does stay, it doesn't fall all the way down. It's going to be right now because it's just being difficult. But anyways, it will stay on your tip. And then you can, if you ever want to take this off, you can just pull it, take it off like that. It comes off very easy. Put this cap back on. Some people do that every time they aren't using it. Um, they put this back on and just put this away, give this a rinse, clean it and put, give, you know, put it away and only use this tip when they're actually working on it. I like to do that if I am not doing things for a while, if I'm not going to be using this glue for a long time, it's a great way of doing it because I just feel like this is a little bit more sealed than this is. I don't know if that's true or not. That's just my personal opinion. Um, I do often use it. I have a smaller bottle that I often put it in like that as well but it is a hassle to refill those bottles this is much easier to do but anyways that is what those tips are for and that is how you install them to use them hope that helped for anyone else who might have had questions about that bye